The official Twitter support account announced big changes to the unclear rules concerning which accounts get verified and which don't. USA Today image of Twitter app, photo, Matt Rock forward slash AP. An IDR University health nurse who posted a controversial tweet last week no longer has a job with the health system. She's not the first person from IDR to face repercussions after a social media post. A tweet tied to former IU Health employee Taisha Baker read, Every white woman raises a detriment to society when they raise a son. Someone with the highest propensity to be a terrorist, rapist, racist, killer, and domestic violence all-star. Historically every son you had should be sacrificed to the wolf's bitch. No longer employed, IU Health Nurse's controversial tweet. Oops. Twitter roasts McDonald's after accidental Black Friday tweet. That went well. Papa John's NFL apology gets crushed on Twitter. Sunday, a statement from IU Health said the person tied to the tweet was no longer an employee. This is only the most recent time a social media post tied to a DR has led to consequences for the poster. Here are some other social media posts that went wrong. In 2015, Concord Community School Board fired assistant softball and track coach Jessica Dooley after she tweeted about burning down a pizza shop whose owners said they didn't want to cater same-sex weddings. Dooley tweeted, who's going to walk a to, into burn down hash memory espitza w me. Agree with hash freedom of religion bill. That's a lifestyle they choose ignorant. Dooley was almost immediately suspended and fired soon after that. In 2011, former ADR Deputy Attorney General Jeff Cox suggested police use live ammunition to clear protesters from Wisconsin's capital. Use live ammunition, Cox wrote in a retweet of a Mother Jones staff member discussing orders to clear protesters. Mother Jones writer Adam Weisty I later confirmed that was what Cox intended to tweet. You're damned right I advocate deadly force, Cox responded. The tweet was sent on a Saturday. Cox was terminated the following Wednesday. In January 2017, Idia State Sen. Jack Sadley, our Idia Polis shared a meme that categorized women participating in women's rights marches across the country as fat women out walking. Jack Sadley is a member of the Adia State Senate. This is what we're dealing with. pig.twitter.com forward slash 7zw1bben. Sadly told Indistar that he thought someone else posted the meme on his Facebook page. Not sure how that ended up on my Facebook wall but that certainly does not reflect my opinion of women, Sunline posted on Facebook soon after the original meme. People who know me will know that's not my view. Sadly remains the Adir State Senate District 36 Senator. In December 2016, Adir State Rep. Jim Lucas shared a photo of a woman in a car's trunk with the words, Wanna know who loves you more your wife or your dog? Lock them both in your trunk and see WHO's happy to see you when you let them out. Laura Berry, executive director for the IDR Coalition Against Domestic Violence, referred to the post as sexist and misogynistic, saying Lucas should no longer hold a leadership position. Lucas deleted the post and apologized.